Jane here with Usborn Books and More and Treasures with Usborn, and I'm going to show you some of our great books for babies and toddlers. Starting with your youngest of readers, um, our little babies. We have a few different um, cloth book series. This one is the Hello Baby. It has these little animals, and you're just learning. You're saying, hello, blue whale, hello, red parrot. The bright pops of color. Every book in the series has this fun little ring where you can move the little, the little buttons on there and you can drool on it, play on it, and then as soon as you're done you can throw it in the washer without even worrying about it. We have so many touchy-feely books but one of our most most popular is a That's Not My series. We have everything from That's Not My Duck, Puppy, Elephant, and our most recent release is That's Not My Unicorn. So every book is told by this little mouse looking for his perfect unicorn. So That's Not My Unicorn, its hooves are too bumpy. You can see it has that bumpy texture on there. And so you can also see the dark outline on each book, on each page. This is great for your little babies who are just beginning, beginning to look at things and it kind of helps them focus on the picture. And this is one of our great series that grows with your family because everyone loves a touchy-feely patch and it's just a really cute story. Very first bus book. I love this book. It's a talk about story. Um, you can see that the wheels move on the page, a really lot of fun. You can talk about the shapes and the colors, what the animals are doing, and it's just a lot of fun to see what your little ones can make up and kind of recognize in each picture. So it's the very first bus book. One of my favorite bedtime stories is Love You Who. This is a sweet little mama owl talking to her baby and just saying how wonderful he is and no matter what happens, he's always going to be great and he's going to go far in life. She says, you make my, you make life feel like sunshine no matter what the weather, and anything is possible as long as we're together. So super cute. I just recommend, this is one of my favorite bedtime stories. A great series for bedtime stories is our five minute bedtime. These are true and tested. They really are about five minutes. You can see there's pages with a lot of text on it, or there are pages with very little text on it and great illustrations. Um, these are great for your little ones who are maybe not as patient, but you still want to read to them. That's a five minute bedtime stories. The alphabet picture book is a perfect picture book for learning the alphabet. It has these cool little tabs to help your little ones turn the pages. And then just has the uppercase and the lowercase letter. And then the picture of what that letter is. Um, and it's really great because it has a thicker, sturdy pages. So you don't have to worry about, uh, worry about them tearing them. You can see the really pretty pictures in there. So that's the alphabet picture book. As your little one gets older, probably about, you know, one and a half, two, they start recognizing objects. They'll definitely want to get one of our very first book of things to spot. This one is around the house, so it just kind of has household objects in each room that your kids can recognize and talk about. You can kind of point to things and talk about colors and shapes and what the kids are doing, what all the animals are doing. So just a lot of fun. I love Peek Inside series for your kids who may be two and up. This is a really um, great beginner nonfiction series. There are a few, a few flaps in there, so you just have to watch them. Um, I love these. It has great pictures. It's full of information. This one is about dinosaurs. We have a whole handful of them from garden to nighttime to farm. Um, you can just kind of see there are lots of fun illustrations in here. Just a ton of information. So that's Peek Inside Dinosaurs. One of our family favorites is the Muddle Match series. This is one of our newest ones. This is the fairy tale one. And we actually have seven books in the series. I love it because when you match up the colors on the side, it has, it has a alliteration with the one letter focusing on that one letter. And then as you mix and match the tabs, you can make a different story and a new character. So you have this crazy little story and it just gets crazy and it's fun. My little girl is um, loving these books just to kind of turn the pages. So that is my little match. Those are some of our great books for your babies and toddlers.